Dana Point Harbor. Should be popping up at about 6.45. We have paddle boarders out here. Just getting started. Hi, Joanne. Thanks for joining me this morning. We've got a seal right in front of us, cruising by. It's pretty cool. How many times do you get to see a seal and the sunrise in one periscope at the same time? Hey, Johnny Finch, what's happening? Everybody follow cool, relaxed. One of the top lawyers in the country. Love that dude. Johnny, what do you think of the sunrise this morning? Not too much, man. I'm just going to share my thoughts about why I think live streaming is changing the world. Why I think live streaming is making the world a better place. So, if you guys could do me a favor, just before the sun's not quite up yet. If I can... Everybody, good morning. How you guys doing? What am I looking at? Over here. Hey, you guys, let's watch the sunrise together this morning. Let's share some thoughts about how we're using Periscope to make the world a better place. I'm Mitch Jackson, streaminglawyer.com. I'm going to show you the sunrise this morning. Behind me is the Pacific Ocean. Down here in Dana Point, you guys, please share this and heart it up if you like it. Let me turn the... Uh... There we go. So do me a favor, guys. Let's, uh, let's heart up this morning's sunrise, if you would. Swipe up on Android, left to right on your iPhones. Share this morning's sunrise with your amazing audiences on Twitter and on Periscope. Really appreciate it. Hey, Joe. Joe Kenny, thanks for joining. And uh, I'll give you guys a shout out as you guys share. Lynn, really appreciate it. Lynn, thanks for sharing. Elise, thank you for sharing. So guys, one of the reasons I wanted to jump on Periscope this morning in addition to sharing the sunrise is to talk a little bit about how live streaming is making the world a better place. 360, okay, real quick, you guys, let me just... Hello, Holland. So this is uh, by the Marine Institute, Dana Point, California. Love this spot. Just between us, you guys, before everyone jumps on, there's a bench to my right. And this is where my kids and I are going to connect when I'm long gone. We have a little deal when the sun sets. They're going to be sitting on the bench, and I'll be coming in over the Pacific Ocean to say hi and to talk to them and help them with their challenges. It's going to be awesome. Share on Android. Hey, Patricia, how you doing? Uh, just swipe up. Swipe up with your finger, and you'll be able to share on Android, left to right on your iPhone. And then to heart it up, you guys, just tap the screen. And uh, no, I don't. My grandmother was French, so. Just tap the screen and that'll heart it up. So a couple of thoughts, you guys. I think live streaming is changing the world. And I want to know your thoughts on, thank you, Pat, for sharing. I really appreciate it. I want to know your thoughts on whether or not you agree with me or how you're using live streaming. This is a sunrise. If I said sunset, I apologize. Sunrise, Southern California, about 6.45 in the morning. You got some guys fishing off the end of the pier down there. You see that? Or the jetty? So... Let's get as many people as we can in here, you guys. Let's share. Hey, Munich, Munich, share this with all your fellow friends in Munich, you guys. Wichita, don't speak Chinese, but, you know, I'd love to be periscoping this sunrise to the Chinese right now, so swipe, swipe if you would. Where are you guys clicking in from real quick? We got England, we've got Holland, we had Australia earlier. I had some friends in California. Hey, Chris, good morning. Boy, it's going by Miami, Isle of Wight, Milwaukee, England, St. Louis, Chicago. Thank you, Johnny, for sharing. Guys, follow Cool Relax, please. He's a buddy of mine. Good guy, Sweden, Washington, Inglewood. Love Inglewood. Great Yarmouth. Great Yarmouth, baby. I love it. Appleton. Edinburgh. We were in Edinburgh uh, about uh, six months ago. Loved it. Texas, Canada. So guys, let's, let's swipe. Swipe up on Android, left to right. Let's get some people in here. Listen, here's why I think live streaming, you guys, is changing the world for the better. Unlike anything we've ever seen before is back in the uh, 1440, 1450, Gutenberg invented the printing press, or at least the modern printing press. And what it did is it, for the first time, allowed information, knowledge, awareness 
to be shared with the masses. Before, only royalty, only the very well-off had access to books, had access to written documents, had access to recorded information. And once the printing press was invented back in, uh, you know, some people believe it was invented before 1440, but at least in Europe, 1440, 1450, it changed everything. Chris, thank you, my friend. Chris, just an outstanding uh, tech guy. You guys connect with Chris with any of your tech issues. It changed everything. It leveled the playing, fan, playing field. And, uh, well, let's get started. Let's give it a chance here. And uh, what's interesting is it really, for the first time, allowed information to be shared around the world about what was happening. And it brought awareness. It brought knowledge. And with information and knowledge and awareness is power. And it really did change societies. It changed civilization. And I think if you fast forward to the Pony Express, the telegraph, the telephone, the television, movies, video, the internet, you know, obviously all of that has amplified the exchange of information, but never before, never before have we as individual human beings been empowered to be mobile publishing companies, to have a publishing tool in our back pocket in our jacket pocket, in our purse, in our hands, on our tripods, and share information. Hey, hello, Alabama. This is Dana Point, California, Orange County, South Orange County, California, Sunrise. For those of you just coming in, swipe up in your Android. Let's share the Sunrise with your, with your family, with your friends, all over the world. Swipe left to right on your iPhone. Tap it up. On, if you want to give me some hearts for the Sunrise, tap it up. And I think, um, yeah, I just love it down here, you guys. Let me show you kind of like a 360. And for the first time, for the first time in the history of our planet, we've all been able, we can all share experiences, we can all share information. Societies that have been held down, repressed, dominated by dictatorships. What do you think is going to happen when, and is happening right now, when they start having access to this information? They start seeing another way to live. They start sharing requests for help. They start teaming up together, using live streaming, using mobile live streaming to become, you know, a powerful community to make change, to make the world a better place. It's never been available before. Yeah, it is. As Chris says, it is and will be the norm. You know, Chris and I, Chris and I have connected on live streaming and on social, and it's just changed everything, hasn't it, Chris? And, you know, I'm talking about, you know what, there are beautiful sunrises all over the world. There's beautiful sunsets over the world. I'm just sharing you mine. Let's not judge everybody. <laughs> you know, and it's interesting how by knocking down walls, by building bridges, by clicking and instantly connecting with people from around the world, you know, it, it really seems to me that we're in for exponentially fast change for the better. And whether it's our personal lives, where we live, what we're doing, whether or not it's our business lives, game changer, baby. This is a game changer. Hong Kong, love Hong Kong, was there for a rotary function back in 94, 95, Hong Kong and Taipei. So for those of you just joining, this is kind of fun. We have New York, Hong Kong, Orange County, Grandmaster ONG, Orange County. Where are you guys, where are you guys watching the sunrise from? Tell me what you want to see. Georgia. Hello, Georgia. Hello, Angela from Georgia. Rotterdam, Melbourne, Australia. Hey, Matt. Good to see you. Grandmaster ONG in Inglewood. Love it. Tennessee, we're just up in Inglewood for a big soccer tournament. Northern Cal, Philadelphia. Hey, Northern Cal. So, guys, while I was setting up, whoa, look at that. Got some waves coming in. Is that kind of cool? Scotland. You know what? I'm going to keep streaming today, guys. We're just going to go for it. This is too pretty down here. So, what do you guys think? Is live streaming changing lives? How, has, how do you think live streaming is going to make the world a better place? Victoria Taylor, follow Victoria Taylor from the UK, you guys. Good morning, Victoria. 
We're talking about live streaming, changing lives, making businesses better, making us all more transparent. tap around real quick just to say hi whoa I don't want to stop the broadcast bear with me guys now hey guys you know I have to say hi I have to I'm gonna go back to the sunrise but I just want to say hi to everybody loving loving the sunrises the sunrise scopes tell me how tell me how live streaming is changing your life it's gonna make the world a better place in the comments tell me how it's you're using it in business I really want to know but let's get back to the sunrise come on come on sunrise Social justice, absolutely, overcome oppression. Well, we have a lot of friends in here, and that's what's really cool. There's a downside, the last bill of privacy. Well, you know, as a lawyer, you guys, I don't see it that way, respectfully. I think transparency is good. And uh, I think once we work out and iron out all the, uh, the kinks, the additional... Hang on a second. There we go. The additional uh, sharing of information, the transparency, no longer. Thank you. Yeah, I'm a, an attorney here in Southern California for 30 years. I love streaminglawyer.com. I try to repurpose all my live streams over at streaminglawyer.com. And for example, we like to use live streaming to show the human side of being a lawyer and, uh, and help people. We try to share our secret sauce and answer questions and and just try to pro provide value to the community. And I think businesses that do that with live streaming, you know, we're all mobile publishing companies right now, you know? Uh, Victoria, guys, follow Victoria Taylor, follow Chris McNamee, two superstars on live streaming, social media, they're doing amazing things. I know it doesn't seem that bright to you, but it's hard for me to see the comments with the sun coming up, so just bear with me if I miss your, your thoughts. So these guys, can you see them uh, fishing off the end of the jetty down there? You know it is, it's about unity. And uh, no, Victoria, you're way too kind. I enjoyed having lunch with you up in San Francisco. That was so much fun at uh, Summit, Summit Live. Look, here's something, I'm just gonna give you guys a little inside scoop when it comes to business and law in the real world, at least the way I've seen it. Uh, without this transparency, most consumers, most people only know what they're allowed to know. Their, their thoughts are premised upon what big companies and big corporations tell them to think through marketing, through media, through advertising, through commercials. And that's not a good thing. And I don't care if it's a local government, big government, I don't care if it's big business, big corporations or small companies. One of the beautiful things about live streaming, you guys, is it allows you to see exactly what's going on. Okay, it allows you to see what's going on or to share what's going on and then you make your own uh, decisions about what's right, what's wrong, what's real, what's, what's, what's not factual, what's speculation. So from a business standpoint, you guys, that's why I'm a firm believer in live streaming. And guys, Hey, Ryan, loved your uh, stream earlier this morning of San Diego in the lights before the sun came up. That was pretty cool. You and I are just a couple of early risers, aren't we? And the reason I feel that way, you guys, is some of our high-profile cases that we've tried, what's written in the newspapers, is nothing close to what's happening in the courtroom. And I think if we had this type of technology in the courtroom, I really do think the consumer would have a completely different perspective of what value lawyers do bring uh, to a civilized society because what you're reading is TMZ in writing in the newspapers and it's nothing to do with what's really happening in our courtrooms. But enough about that. Look at this, you guys. So, Victoria, this corner down here is high tide, but you can walk around the corner down there and uh, I don't know if you can see the little houses up on top, but when the kids were younger, we'd walk around the corner down there and I would tell them leprechauns lived up above. And we'd walk around that corner and they would look up, their eyes were as big as saucers, wondering if they'd be able to catch a glimpse of the little leprechauns that lived up on top. It was so funny. 
But then, of course, to this day, I'm sticking to my story, even when we hike out there. I still tell them the leprechauns are still up there. You know, denial till death, right? Look at that. So I don't know if you can see the red buoy straight out, but when you when you jet ski or paddleboard out there, Ryan, you know, there's usually 10 to 15 sea lions all jockeying for position on top of that red buoy. And then that's Catalina Island. You guys see Catalina Island all the way out there? He had some great diving trips out there. That's where Periscope Ryan did his uh, water underwater periscopes. One of them, anyway. But let's get back to the sunrise. Yeah, I love it here. This is just awesome. So do me a favor, you guys. Let's uh, let's try bringing in some more people. You know, we got 60 people watching the live stream. You know, let's swipe up on Android. Let's swipe left to right on your iPhones. Let's see if we can get up to 100 people watching. That's our challenge right now. Let's see if we can hit 100. Let's share this Southern California sunrise with 100 people right now. Oh, I will. Thank you very much. Thanks, Karen. Love what you're doing, Karen, with your, with your designs, your illustrations. Very, very talented. Just so much, so cool to watch. Gen genuinely impressed. I just love it. So let me send an open invitation to you guys. If you guys are ever down here in Southern California, Orange County, and we're South Orange County, okay, Dana Point, Laguna Niguel, San Clemente. San Clemente is just right, whoa, did you guys hear that? It's just, it's just right, uh, as far as you can see to the right. Laguna Beach is on the other side of me. Reach out to me, you guys. Reach out to me ahead of time, and let's grab breakfast, lunch, or dinner. I would love to bring you guys down here, share a sunset, share a sunrise with you. Open invitation. Here comes the sun. I can hear the waves cracking over my shoulder. Check this out. <laughs> They're getting closer and closer. Who are your favorite periscopers, you guys? Who do, who do I need to follow? Who are you following? Who's your one Periscoper, your one live streamer that you're following that you'd like to share with my audience this morning? Uh, grew up playing basketball down at the beach, loved it. FullScopeTV.com. Who can we all follow, you guys? Put them in there and I'll give them a shout out. I agree, Chris. There are some of my favorites in the scope right now, too. Well, you don't have to pick just one. You can pick a couple. Victoria. Ryan Bell. Ryan Steinelson, Periscope Ryan, Kim Garst, Kathy Hackle, Victoria Taro, Taylor, Brian, Brian Panzo, Patrick Perota, Kathy, Ryan, yeah, I agree. Alex Khan, we're going to have Alex Khan on our show on Monday. The show.live, 2 p.m. Eastern, join us. Alex is our special guest. Look at this real quick. You know what, let me uh, turn this around just to say hi. Trying to turn this up. Hey guys, good morning. It's good to see everybody. Another beautiful day in paradise. Boy, it's, I can't even see it, it's so glary. Just want to say hi everybody. Enjoy the sunrise, it's gonna be it's awesome, awesome sunrise. Hey, how many of you have been down here to Dana Point? If you guys have been to Dana Point, give me a uh, thumbs up in the comments if you would, please. I'm just curious. 
Ryan, you probably paddleboarded up here, pal. San Diego, we're looking right down towards Ryan. Ryan, give us a give us a wave right now from San Diego, right now. Okay, wow, we got a lot of thumbs. <laughs> Can everyone wave back to Ryan down in San Diego? It's just on the other side of that sunrise. Oh, this is awesome. Got some early morning fishermen out to uh, catch some fish. Check this out. Here comes some big waves. Ryan, what do you think? Let's screenshot this, you guys. As soon as the waves hit this rock, it's going to be an awesome screenshot. Trust me. Get ready. Screenshot it right now. Whoa. Almost just got taken out. Okay, here comes another one. Get ready for a screenshot. It's going to be awesome. Hey, good morning. Absolutely. Thanks for stopping by. You have a great day, too. I can't read the comments, guys. It's really hard, so I apologize if I'm missing anything. It's just really, really, the sun's right in my eyes. It is peaceful. What a great way to start the day, you know? So listen, at the beginning of the scope, we talked a little bit about why. All right, sounds good. Take care. Why live streaming is changing the world. Why I think it's changing the world for the better. Some of you shared your thoughts. Um, my takeaway from today's scope, you guys, is number one, what a great way to start the day. And I hope this sunrise helped you start the day with a smile on your face. Number two, I hope Maybe it gave you a couple of different ideas on how to embrace live streaming, regardless of the platform, to help others, to build bridges, to knock down walls, to share information, to share knowledge, uh, to share awareness, to help make the world a better place. I think if we all do that, we're going to see exponential change over the next couple of years, unlike ever before. Hey, pre appreciate the hearts, you guys. You guys are awesome. We are connected globally, absolutely. I feel the same way. That's why, you know, that's why I'm doing this. This is unprecedented. Yeah, we talked about 1440, 1450, Gutenberg in Europe creating or at least fine tuning the modern printing press and how that changed everything. And you fast forward today past the printing press, the Pony Express, the telegraph, radio, television, internet. And now, live streaming. It's amazing. Guys, if you're in Southern California, if you're in Dana Point, uh, you're going to be in town, reach out to me through streaminglawyer.com. Connect with me. Let's meet. Let's have lunch. Let's have dinner. Let's watch a sunrise or sunset together. I'm going to head on out of here, you guys. Thanks for stopping by this morning. Really, really appreciate it. And I hope you guys all make today your masterpiece. Take care, you guys. Bye-bye.